the Irish Gold Cup. Next, this is a Grade One chase, of course. Bring me luck, Graham Glutterbuck. Folk etymology: Leon Van Rensburg, Little Rock Hood, Vinnie Gerard, Wooden Ship, Leon Van Rensburg, Briarwood Lady, Jim Murray, Yorker Dream, David Hooley, My Place Later Days, James Shea, Nightclub of Craig Beckwith, Ocean of Lecker, Darren Thompson, Queen of the Night, John Morgan, Seminal Word. Alex Cherry, Stalky Dove, John Morgan, The Widow, Joshua Sutherland, and Vermont, Alex Cherry. This is the big grade one this week, but over a three-mile trip, but I reckon the Bobby Joe on Monday is probably going to turn out to be a better Gold Cup trial than this one. They're away and racing, because this is ever two furlongs shorter, and I reckon that Bobby Joe, which was over just a furlong shorter, might be a better race, because there were some big ones in that, and it was a good race as well. So anyway, this one could well be just as good, and there's some big ones in this as well. Yeah, looking at Wooden Ship and the Widow probably as the main two, but Storky Dove has gone off into the lead for John Morgan as they get into the second, and they're all safely over that one with Storky Dove setting the pace. The Grey Brywood Lady is just about second, and a Little Rock Hood and Queen of the Night, and then the Widow and Bring Me Luck Nightclub is also close up as they get the next nightclub will be a Definite force in the Gold Cup next week. Always there or thereabouts in the big races. And Storky Dove is the leader. He's one of those horses not Nightclub has been around for quite a few seasons. I don't think anybody would mind if he won the Gold Cup next week. I don't think anybody would mind if he won this this week either. Well, apart from maybe one or two of the other trainers are in it, but you know what I mean. Good to see these horses that come back season after season and continually run well, picking up their big prize, getting their day in the sun, rather than the flash in the pan ones that just turn up for one season. And there's a faller there, and it's Bring Me Luck. So, Bring Me Luck is out of it. So, sorry, Gray, I didn't bring you any luck there with that one. Stalking Duff continuing to lead. About four lengths to Briarwood Lady in second, the Widow third, then Night Clubber, uh, Little Rock Hood, Queen of the Night, Notion of Lecker as they get over the next. Which they're all over safely. Folk etymology and wooden ship, the two Leon Van Rensburg horses are right out the back. But if you remember back to a race a week or two ago, they did something similar then as well and finished like absolute trains. Anyway, they're coming up past the big screen. Passing the winning post shortly, then going out for a full circle of the track there on the outside track here, so it's slightly longer than the other one. So, a full circuit of the track is a full 14 furlongs, which of course is a mile and three quarters. So, you're on that inside track, it's only about a mile and a half. They get to this next ditch, and they're all safely over it. With Storky doing the lead. Stable companion Queen of the Knights moving into second. Uh, they get over that next one. It'll be interesting to see what happens with some of these horses next week. Which ones go in the Gold Cup? And then, of course, there's the open handicap, isn't there, as well? And some of them will, no doubt, the big guns will go in that and push everything out of the handicap. Makes it just a sort of reserve Gold Cup race as they get over the next. And they're all safely over that one. Whatever happens, I'm pretty sure that John Morgan will have a front runner in both of them, or all of them, because there's the, the, some others as well. And they will be setting the pace of the race, and they'll be dictating what happens, as we saw at Warwick last week. And they're all over that one. The total complexion of the race changes when a front runner falls, and the pace just drops right off. They're over that one, and there's a faller there. It's Ocean of Lecker that's gone. So Ocean of Lecker's gone for Darren Thompson. Already taken a grade one today, so I'm going to take this one. But he's already had one big winner as they can't pass the cheap seats for the final time. And take that one nice to Storky doing the lead. The Widow is in second, Queen of the Night back in third. Mallorca Dream is next, then Nightclub and Brawl Lady Little Rock Hood is next. Then come Wooden Ship and Folk Etymology both starting to creep closer. My Place Later Days is next, and then Vermont and Seminole Word bringing up the rear mistake there. By folk etymology, just as it was starting to get going. And I've put pain to that one's chance, really, as the widow goes into the lead. The widow then is leading now 
from Storky Dove in second. Queen of the Night looks to be travelling nicely in third. They've got three to jump. This will be the final ditch, I think, when they come up to it. The Widow just being steadied with Storky Dove in second. Then in third place is Queen of the Night. Wooden Ship Mallorca Dream is after that. Then Nightclub on the inside just being rousted along. Bit of a gap then to Brian Wood Lady and Folk Etymology. Then Little Rock Hood and My Place later today. Seminole Word and Vermont are out of it. They're racing down to the second last. Over the second last they go. And the Widow landed in front. The Widow from Storky Dove in second. Mallorca Dream is now moving into second on the outside. Wooden Ship is start. No, it's Folk Etymology. Sorry, he's making the good ground on the outside. Wooden Ship is chasing its stable companion. Nightclub are on the inside. They're heading down towards the final fence. And the widow is shot clear. It's the widow who's three to four clear. Then now of Mallorca Dream over the final fence. They go. The widow took that really well and got away from it well. And the widow is four lengths clear. And she's going to take this one. I think Mallorca Dream is in second. Wooden Ship is running on in third. Queen of the Night in fourth. Then back to Nightclub. But it's the widow into the final furlong. Well clear with Mallorca Dream starting to close in second. But not going to get anywhere near close enough. It could be a different story next week. Going two furlongs further. But it's the widow that takes it today. The Yorker Dream is going to be second. Queen of the Night is third. Then Night Club of Four. Snorky Dove, Wooden Ship, Brywood Lady, My Place, Later Days. After that one. And the widow takes it nicely. Josh Washington's got a big hand for the Chilton Gold Cup next week. And he's got some big decisions to make as to which ones he puts in. Which ones he doesn't. The Widow takes it for Josh Russell. The Mallorca Dream, David Hooley second. Queen of the Night, John Morgan third. Nightclub of Crane Beckwith fourth. And then Storky Dove for John Morgan was fifth.